This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at the reactions of the alcohols. The first reaction we look at is combustion. So alcohols undergo combustion in excess oxygen, which is complete combustion, to form carbon dioxide and water. In the first equation, we have methanol burning in oxygen to form carbon dioxide and water. In the second equation, we have ethanol burning in oxygen to form carbon dioxide and water. The second type of reaction that alcohols undergo is oxidation. Primary alcohols are oxidized by acidified potassium dichromate and heat to form aldehydes or carboxylic acids. In this reaction, we start with a primary alcohol, which is ethanol. Our oxidizing agent is acidified potassium dichromate. The conditions are heat and distillation, and then we produce an aldehyde. If we continue to oxidize the aldehyde, again using the acidified potassium dichromate, but this time it's heat with reflux, we produce a carboxylic acid. So depending on the conditions used, we can oxidize a primary alcohol to an aldehyde, that's heat and distillation, or a carboxylic acid, that's heat and reflux. In both cases, the oxidizing agent, which is acidified potassium dichromate, is the same. In this reaction, we have a color change from orange to green. Next, we look at secondary alcohols. Secondary alcohols are oxidized by acidified potassium dichromate and heat to form ketones. In this reaction, we have a secondary alcohol, which is propan-2-ol. The oxidizing agent is acidified potassium dichromate. The conditions are heat and reflux, and the product is a ketone, which is propanone. In this reaction, we also get a color change from orange to green. And finally, we have tertiary alcohols. Tertiary alcohols cannot be oxidized by acidified potassium dichromate. This is because there are no hydrogen atoms bonded directly to the carbon which is bonded to the OH group. This carbon atom in the middle which is bonded to the OH group is bonded to three other carbon atoms. It is not bonded to a hydrogen atom, therefore it cannot be oxidized. And in this reaction, we have no color change. The solution will remain orange.